Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Dr. Peter Vertigam, and I'm the Vice President of LifeVantage for the European markets. Today I'm going to talk to you about our breakthrough nutrition products called Protanim Nerve 1 and Protanim Nerve 2. These two products are so unique that for me it was the main reason to join the company of LifeVantage. My background is in biochemistry. I spent a lot of years in developing nutritional products in providing them with the scientific backing through clinical studies. And I really am convinced that these two products are the most innovative products on the market today. For what would you say? Well, I think it is for the most prominent health concern that we are facing in our modern day society. And you would say, what is that prominent health concern? Well, I would argue it is the process of aging. Aging is normal. We all face it. There's nothing to be worried about. Our body knows exactly that we age, and our body knows exactly how to deal with it. The problem is, in our modern day society, we are facing a lot of different mechanisms that are having causing a problem with our aging that we didn't face many years ago. And that's why we need to actively intervene in that aging process. And pretending nerve one and nerve two do that exactly. Together, they work to combat the most pressing issues that we have when we age. We do that through a concept called nutrigenomics. Nutrigenomics is influencing the gene expression by using natural ingredients. And why would we want to influence the gene expression? Well, you have to realize that all our cells, more billions of cells that we have in our body, contains nuclei, and in that nucleus is the DNA molecule. And today we can read off the DNA molecule in a matter of seconds we can find out exactly what our manual is for our body, what the code is that lies behind our body's function. And as I said, we're talking today about aging, and if we could only influence the way we are aging. Here you see a lady uh, from young to old, and you know, aging is a process that goes throughout all our life. It doesn't start only at 60 or 70 years of age. It starts already at the age of 20 when we have reached the optimal health and when our body starts to slowly uh, decline, accumulate damage. That is exactly what we're facing today. And we have developed those two products to combat the most pressing issues of aging. First of all, what we see is that we have a slow accumulation of damage to our body. I'll explain to you in a moment where that damage comes from. We have a reduction of energy production. We have a uh, reduction of sleep efficiency. We have reduction of neural clarity. In fact, there are many aspects of aging that come along and we see them all around us. We can also see how our aging process has changed over the years. First of all, if we compare, let's say, a couple of hundred years ago in the medieval ages, we died of very different reasons. Our different lifespan, our lifespan was typically 45 years, very young, we died, and we died of very sudden reasons, like infections. Today, we live much longer. We have solved the medieval times health problems. But in return, we've gotten many other disease concerns, and we call those degenerative diseases. Degenerative diseases are health concerns that don't suddenly happen overnight, but they take years to develop. A good example is cardiovascular disease. You don't get a heart attack overnight. It takes years to develop until that moment comes. Only one example. If you look at the European Union data, for the reasons for dying in Europe, you see that over 95% are these degenerative health concerns. Cardiovascular disease is clearly number one. Cancer is clearly number two. Um, neurological diseases is also very high up in the list. So we are looking at slow damage to our body. Now, where does that damage come from? Well, it has to do with oxidative stress. You may have heard of this oxidative stress. It's also a very normal process. In fact, we need it in order to function properly. Our body needs oxidation uh, in our, because that's the way we function. The big source of oxidative stress is oxygen, and therefore you can understand we need it, otherwise we wouldn't be able to survive. We need oxygen. Our body knows that, and when it uses oxygen, it goes through a cycle by changing this oxygen molecule through different stages of very harmful molecules until it reached the water molecule. This is the normal process that happens in our body. 
And as you can see, these dangerous intermediate molecules in our body called free radicals, causing a lot of damage in our body. Damage to DNA, damage to cells, damage to our eyes, damage to our brain. Many organs are um, having the, the, the problems of a slow accumulation of damage. Fortunately, our body knows about this, and that's why it has developed specific protection mechanisms, like glutathione, catalase, or superoxide dismutase. These are enzymes that have one job in our body, and that is to prevent, as much as possible, this damage occurring in our body. Now, all good, would you say? Well, the problem is that through our lifestyle and through external influences that we're facing, the protection is no longer optimal. Ideally, we have a balance. We have a balance between free radicals, as I said, what we need, and the protection. But our lifestyle has changed a lot. We are having a lot of external pollution. And if you live in a city like this, or in an environment that there's a lot of chemicals in the air, which we all have in all parts of the world, some parts more than others, of course, we breathe in extra free radicals. So the balance is going to be disturbed. If we have bad lifestyle habits, like smoking, we breathe in voluntarily extra free radicals, further disturbing the balance. But it's not just unhealthy things. Also, healthy things cause a disturbance of the balance. For example, if you run every day, it's very healthy. Keep on doing it. But it uses more oxygen in our body. And if we use more oxygen, we are going to get a further reduction of the balance because the oxygen is being transferred in our body to dangerous free radicals. And then on the other side, our intake of antioxidants, the molecules that prevent damage from free radicals, has been drastically reduced. We don't eat a lot of good, healthy fruits and vegetables anymore, which are the primary sources of antioxidants. We don't eat uh, a lot of healthy things anymore. In fact, we eat a lot of foods that are not very rich in antioxidants. And also, if we eat apples, we eat very strange source of apples. It's no longer the apple that we used to know 50 or 100 years ago. We use very many strange production techniques. And using chemicals on apples means that we are going to reduce the amount of antioxidants in our daily fruits and vegetables. And that's very easy to investigate. If you buy an apple, you cut it in half, you put it on the table countertop, it's going to turn brown. That is exactly that oxidative stress process. And if you do that with an apple that came from a tree in your garden, you're going to see also turning brown, because just as any other apple, that apple will also oxidize, but it takes so much more longer before it turns brown. Meaning that the apple that we get from our crops today from the supermarkets is much lower in antioxidant content. And that results in a completely disbalance. We have extra uh, damage from accumulation from our environment. We do funny things like smoking, voluntarily increasing the intake of uh, free radicals. We have, for example, activity that completely disturbs the balance. And on the other hand, our antioxidant intake is reduced and our natural processes that our body has developed to take care of these free radical damages is also not functioning optimally. This is where we come in with protanin nerve one and nerve two. We restore the balance that we want to create in our body. And we do that with primarily protanin nerve two. This is the first product we launched in Europe on our markets. Protanin stimulates the effectiveness of superoxide dismutase. Superoxide dismutase is the most prominent, the most important antioxidant enzyme in our body. It is only there to stimulate the processes that our body has developed to take away these dangerous free radicals. Now, in our body, there is basically two ways of taking away free radicals. One is antioxidants, like vitamin C, which are very healthy. Keep on taking them, keep on using them. But if you think about it, it is one molecule taking away one free radical, and then it's done. An enzyme, like superoxide dismutase, influences a lot of mechanisms in our body, and here you see an overview of all those mechanisms. And by doing so, it's constantly working to get rid of those dangerous free radicals. And that's why it's much more effective to stimulate enzymatic processes rather than using simple antioxidants. Now, how do we do that? We do that by combining natural ingredients. We believe in natural ingredients. And natural ingredients are the source of our modern-day healthcare. 
There's nothing funny about natural ingredients. Maybe we don't have a lot of chemical, um, biological research behind them. And that's because there is difficulty in finding research funds to study all the aspects of a natural ingredient. Also, it is a mixture of many different phytonutrients, nutrients from plants. Compare that to pharmaceuticals, which is simply one molecule, it's much easier to do research behind that. And also, of course, the pharmaceutical companies spend a lot more money in investigating the effects. Nevertheless, I would argue that most modern-day pharmaceuticals have their origin in natural remedies, in natural, uh, natural components from many centuries around the world. Now, we combine five of them, and we have selected those components based on the knowledge available, how they interfere in the process that we want to optimize, the protection against free radical damage. I'll show you the five ingredients in a moment, but this is one important one. And I've illustrated to use a, a way of describing how we do the research. We know about the history of green tea that you see here, also called Camellia sinensis. And years ago, centuries ago, people didn't know why it was healthy. They just used it and recognized the health benefits it gave them. Now with modern day technology, we can find out exactly which phytonutrients are part of this plant having the beneficial effects. That means that we can zoom in to those molecules and we can create extracts that really maximize the effect that a plant like green tea has. I told you we have five ingredients, green tea, turmeric, bacopa muneri, uh, black pepper, and milk thistle. And these five ingredients have been selected because of their effect. And now comes a very interesting effect that you wouldn't expect at first sight. You think, We've done the testing of all these five ingredients on the effect it has on the stimulation of the nerve two pathway, on the protection against free radicals in our body. And we have the results. We have been published the results. You can read about it in our scientific reports. Green tea had an effect in our test of two, turmeric two, bacopa 1.3, pepper two, and milk thistle 0.8. And you would expect that if you put all these five ingredients together in one product, you would expect the sum to be the effect that the product has, which is eight. And now comes the fantastic thing in nature, which you don't see in pharmaceutical intervention, and that is called synergy. If we do the test for nerve two on the stimulation of the biological pathway, we get 36. And that is what we call synergy. Ingredients working together to maximize their initial effect. The initial effect may be small, together they're a powerhouse in stimulating the protection against free radicals and ensuring that we limit the damage that free radicals can do. That is synergy. Now this is an in vitro test, meaning in the lab, meaning zooming in on the biological pathways. We have many clinical studies, and you can read all about them. We have studied the effect of protanin nerve 2 in uh, elderly people, in highly active athletes, in people that are suffering mostly from oxidative stress. We have proved that this product is doing what we tell it does. It stimulates the nerve two pathway in our body, and by doing so, it reduces the oxidative damage that we are facing every day. You too, you too, where you are living, you are facing oxidative stress damage over the years of our life, of your life. And that's why you want to be starting protecting your body for that oxidative damage by using protanin nerve 2. That was nerve 2. One aspect of reduction of damage due to aging. The second one is the slowdown of energy production. And we all, we all know that. If we are growing older, also from the age of 20, as I said, we are slowly reducing the amount of energy that we can produce. Now, where is the energy produced in our body? It is in the nucleus. Here you see the cell, and here you see the nucleus, and there are little parts in our cells that we call mitochondria. Here you see them. Mitochondria, here you see a big picture of it, is the cell production plants of our body. We have them in all the cells. Some, some cells have more of them, like the heart cell, the heart muscle cell, because it needs a lot of energy. And some cells do not have that many of them because they don't need to produce that much energy. The most producing energy cells have a lot of mitochondria. It produces ATP which is the fuel molecule of our body. 
adenosine triphosphate. You don't have to remember that, but it is the energy production cell molecule of our body. Now, this molecule is produced in a biological process which we call the Krebs cycle. What we do with protanum is we make sure that that mechanism is working smoothly and optimally throughout your life, ensuring optimal energy production. We do that by creating mitochondria, making sure that more mitochondria are present, and we do that by activating the mitochondria, the existing ones making them more efficient. We do again by five different natural ingredients, carnitine, quercetine, alpha lipoic acid, coenzyme Q10, and grape extract. These have been selected on their scientific merit to stimulate the energy production. And again there, we have a great synergistic effect in protanin nerve one. Here's the Krebs cycle, a very complicated mechanism that keeps on turning as an engine in all our cells in the mitochondria producing this very important ATP molecule. ATP, as said, the energy molecule of our body. Now, there are many components in that process that can be reduced in efficiency over time. Many enzymes do different jobs in that cycle. Our ingredients stimulate key enzymes in that process in order to make sure that we have ad adequate energy production. For example, acetylcarnitine. This molecule ensures that an important building block, which we call call A, is being delivered into the Krebs cycle. I mean, it's maybe a complicated process, but you have to see it as a factory with a lot of components working together. And if one fails, or if one is not as effective anymore, the whole cycle is going to be reduced in effectiveness. We have alpha lipoic acid found in almost all plants, but if we stimulate it by taking more of that that we can get from plants over the time that we age, we are going to be having more effective Krebs cycle. Coenzyme Q10, a very well-known molecule which has so much research behind it, showing that it stimulates the energy production. Much research has been done with energy uh, production in the heart muscle. Every doctor knows that CoQ10 is important in ensuring an optimal heart function. We take usually only three to six milligrams per day from our food. If you stimulate it, you're gonna get more energy because 95% of the energy production in our body is related to CoQ10. We do a lot of research. Also for this product, we didn't go out the door without proper research backing it up. We have tests done in vitro on the nerve one path cycle in our body, on the MTC01 path cycle in our body. And you know these are maybe complicated concepts, but you have to realize if we do tests like that, we zoom in again on the key components of this energy production cycle, and we test the efficacy of our ingredients on those aspects. And we have that. We have four different tests, four critical components of the energy production mechanism, and we see a clearly improvement of all these mechanisms if we combine the five ingredients of protein nerve one. We have proved that our product stimulates the production of energy, and that makes this product, together with NERV2, a fantastic combination to prevent, to prevent developing the health concerns that we are facing when we're aging. Let me tell you what the concept of prevention is, in my view. It's a simple picture of how I see prevention. This is your age, this is your life quality, and this is your life curve. We have a life quality of almost zero when we get born. It goes up quickly till the age of 20, as I said, and that is when the slowing down starts. That is when the aging process kicks in. Your life quality slowly is reduced. And when you have a disease, when you're dealing with traditional intervention, taking a product for a specific health concern, you do so when you have that disease. You wait till your life quality is seriously low when you have the disease and you take a pill. And because you take a pill, you're gonna have a life extension and a little bit of extra life to your total life curve. Now here's the difference with prevention. Prevention is you don't wait till you have the disease. You do that today. You start taking prevention with pretending nerve one and nerve two when you're still healthy, at your best years in your life. And by doing so, you have a much bigger effect on your life curve. You have an increased life quality and you have an increased life quantity. 
And that means many more years to your life. That is what we want to achieve. We're not going to achieve necessarily lengthening your life by pushing away degenerative health concerns, but we also want to make sure that the quality of those lives that you get is going to be very beneficial and worth living. This is the power of prevention. Don't wait until you're sick. Start preventing your problems today and increasing your life quality. Our combination product, Pretend and Nerve 2 and Nerve 1, is fantastic. You want to take them both. Together, they combat the negative effects of aging. In fact, we can say that you're going to improve your performance by more energy production, something that we all want if we're growing old. You're going to be enhancing particularly the peak energy production. If you prepare yourself cells that they're going to need to be delivering extra energy when you need it, for example, when you're going to be lifting some heavy stuff or when you're going to take a long walk or when you're doing some other extra strenuous exercise to your body, you're going to be need extra energy. When you prepare your body with Pretend and Nerve 2, Nerve 1, that this energy is available, you're going to have it much more readily uh, usable in those processes. You're going to be increasing your cellular energy. You're going to be promoting your better sleep, which is a mechanism that we have discovered by many people who reported this beneficial effect when they started taking Nerve 1. And, of course, you're going to be more having more active mitochondria. But the most important thing together, you reduce the risk for degenerative diseases because you reduce the oxidative stress that you're facing in your body. You decrease your cellular damage. And, generally said, you slow down the process of aging. That is why the combination of Protan and Nerve 1 and Nerve 2 makes you live your life at peak performance. And isn't that what we've all want? Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for your interest in our my presentation on Protandem Nerve 1 